Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm your special guest Marco. I'm good today. I'm going to explain you how to cue your choreographies. If you don't know me, click here, subscribe, and you will see all my videos. So let's go today. Okay, I will take a choreography that I did yesterday. I'm going to break it down to you. So, and I'm going to explain you with my technique and my cueing. So. First of all, in my videos I don't speak very much because if I do, I will going to speak in English or in French. So I just want to do with my cueing. First of all, my, my choreography, I'm going to embed a command uh, that is going to help people to understand a little bit uh, easy, uh, a little bit with an easy, easy way my choreography. So what I do when I start, I'm going to start with two stomps or a baby mambo. If I want to do baby mambo, I know that this is going to be something that I'm going to embed in my student's mind, okay? So I'm going to try to do it with a baby mambo. What I do, I'm going to start with a march. So when I start marching, I'm going to do just this, okay? Marching, one, two, um, up. Just one, one, two, okay? What I did on my eight counts, then I'm going to start and I'm going to do a baby mambo. I'm going to just indicate to my person what I'm going to do. Okay, a baby mambo two times. Do I have a baby mambo here and a baby mambo here? Okay. If I do a baby mambo, I need to indicate clearly that I'm going here. Okay. Baby mambo, and then I'm going to do this. Okay. With my with my stance, with my position, I'm going to do my torso. I'm going to do this. Okay. So then I'm just going to fall down. Okay, with the left leg. Okay, if I choose not to do with a with a baby mambo, if I choose to do with a with the two stumps, I'm going to do just things like this. Okay, just this. Okay, put the hand down to indicate them that they need to put their right leg on the step, and then I'm going to do just this two times to to show them. I'm going to do. Okay. Then I'm going just to march. So I'm going to explain you here. Um, um, march. Okay. I'm showing this to show them how to just march. Okay. This is indicating that there is nothing that is going to happen between two of my variations. So here, here. Or I choose to do two stomps. Okay. Then I'm going to do with my variation, I'm going to do it to the side. Okay? So my elbow is going to be here, here, because this is going to indicate my feet, and then I'm going just here. Okay, up and backwards. Okay? Here and backwards. Really easy. And backwards. Two. Up and backwards. This is one option. The second option that I can do is with the keyboard change, directly with the keyboard change without any orientations. Okay? So what I can do, I can do here, up, pam pam, here. Okay? This time I'm just going to indicate with my leg. So I'm going to do with my leg, okay? And I'm going to fall down. If, if I choose maybe mambo, maybe mambo, I'm going to do it here, up, up, and I'm going to fall down. Okay, fall down to show them that you're going to do a kickball change. Or I'm going to go, for instance, here, option, and bam. Okay, so, repeat, fall down, okay, and it's on. So then I want to elevate myself on the step. So I have one, two, bam, 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 and here, okay. I need to elevate myself because I'm going to do the next move that's going to be really easy move. So here, indicate, fall down, land to yourself, and then march. Okay, one more time. Indicate, down, and then I'm going to do a baby mambo here. Okay, here, so then I'm going to put my hand, indicate my hand, a baby mambo. Okay, it's going to be really easy for my students to know what I'm going to do. So, from the star, from the here, from my choreo, fall down, lift up, and baby mambo, okay? I need to uh, 
higher, I need to be higher. Okay, I need to elevate myself, and then I'm going to go down here. Okay, so let's go. One, two, kill go chain, hop, and hop. Why? Because my next variation is going to be a twist and a knee. Okay, so here, bam, twist, okay, and a step knee. Okay, so from here, two, bam, bam, twist. I'm going to turn with my elbows, my hands. Show a twist, and then here I'm going to cue here. Hop, hop. Okay. Five, four, six, seven. Okay. Indications, 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 indications. Okay. Then when I have this, I want to change my knee. I want to su surprise my students. If I don't want to do a surprise, I'm going to do it a little bit different. But in my career, you have a surprise. So here I'm going to uh, I'm going to variate it, and it's going to be become sorry a chasse. Okay. So from the beginning, from the top, here kickball change variation, and here I'm going to do a step. Normally it's step, knee, but I want to do a surprise for my students. So I'm going to do step chasse, and then I march. Okay. When I do here chasse, I'm going to do just a thing like this, okay? It's indicating them to go down and up and down, okay? Chasse. Okay? Down and up and down, okay? I like this movement because it's really cool to do chasse like this or chasse with two hands, okay? Or just one hand here and then chasse like here, okay? Okay? Then I'm going to march, marches. Marches, whatever we want. Okay? So, from the top, from the top, here, indications, here, indication, here, indication, chasse. Okay. Then in my choreo, you have, if you saw my choreo, you have here, you have step, baby combo, up, Okay. Like I said before, well, like I said in the beginning of my video, if you choose to do it with a baby mambo, if you choose to embed the command of a baby mambo, it will, it will be a little bit simpler for you to learn your students this coming. So, what can I do? I'm just going to do a step baby mambo here, okay? I'm going to do it on the floor. Step baby mambo, and I'm going to march, okay? Step, I'm going to indicate really clearly, step, and march, okay? Indications of here, or if I want, I like this because it can be really useful. So, Q, boom, and you march. Then, you know that you have another baby mambo. So, you have step baby mambo and then you fall. Okay? It's the thing that you did the, the before. You have here falling down. Okay, so it will be really easy for your clients to understand this movement. So you have here, and then you fall down, and then you march. Okay, so one more time here. So here, and you fall down, and you march, and that's all. Okay. So this is one of one of things that you can do. There is another thing that you can do. If you want to uh, surprise a little bit your clients, if you want, you are going to do here, up, and then you're going to do baby mambo, sorry, and then you're baby mambo, and you're going to do baby mambo. Okay, this is another another thing that they are going to forget. They're going to forget about it, but it will be some, sometimes it will be much easier to do it on the step because the clients will remember it really easy. Okay. So when I have this, when I have this one, so when I have this one, I'm going to I'm going to embed it here, okay? It's it's a really it's another tactic. So my music is going up. I'm going to do from the top. So I'm going here. I'm going to embed. Sorry, chasse. 
So I'm going to embed my move here, and then when they are sufficiently, uh, they were, were, when they uh, sufficiently learn, I'm going to do a little turn, okay, here, and I'm going to push, push here, okay, another one. So from the top, here, bam, here, indication, up here, step, chasse, here, little bit of turn, here. And here, okay. Now I'm going to do a variation. I'm going to break down here and I'm going to accelerate here. I'll accelerate here, okay. So sometimes they don't see me, okay. Sometimes they don't see me, and it's a very good thing. So because it can, it, it can create a surprise or a wow effect, okay. Magic fitness. What I want to do here in my choreography, I'm really going to surprise you all. So if you if you watch it, I do uh, I do the thing like this. Okay, um, and here, um, um, okay. The move is really easy. If I want, if I don't want a surprise, I'm going to push all the things here. So I'm going to do. It's really simple, it's really simple, so I don't do it because there is no wow effect, okay, there is no wow, there is just, okay, he's doing and now he's going to bed here, it's really easy, okay, so, you know the indications, you did the indications here, and you did the indications here, okay, you did it in your baby mambo, so now you need to surprise your, your students, from the top, here, here, okay, here, here and then surprise pom, pom, pom. okay and then the marches to complete your counts this is a one 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 way to do okay indicate really that you go down down okay down down I like this because I took it I took it from Sergey uh, Oleginov, really good, really good uh, presenter. So here and here, you know, you need to really do a parallel move because they are really good. Okay, so show the people that are going down. Then when you do this, you're going to, to do a little bit of cheating. You're going to do uh, the things that they are going to uh, uh, for them to forget, forget your first uh, first part of your choreography. So what you are going to do, you are going to insert insert uh, ten counts. Okay, you are going to do this. Baby mambo, baby mambo, really easy. Okay, this indicating that you are going to do a basic step. Okay, you can do it here. I like this. I like this one. Just indicating them that you are going to do, sorry, that you are going to do a bit more. Okay? Real easy, real cool. So, then I'm going to do a little bit of variation. So, here, and then I'm going from the top here, baby mambo, baby mambo, and I'm going to, um, I'm going to use my anchor to be more efficient in my, in my learnings. So, in my teaching, sorry. Um, Okay, then I have block shots. So then, uh, then I can do here. Then my baby mama will be oriented and oriented here. Okay, or I can do here because I want to do uh, a little bit of surprise. Here, okay, indication, indication, and then I am up. Queuing. So I want to do a block shots. I'm going to do there a baby mambo and I'm going to go uh, backwards on my baby mambo. So, block chasse, baby mambo, and here orientation. Okay. So, one, two, two. Block chasse, block sh chasse, I can do this. Block chasse, baby mambo education, education with my torso, then I'm going to turn around and it's Okay, so one more time, here, block chassé, you're going to be really 
really low in your stance. Chassé, backwards, and your heavy go. So, when I do this, when I have this, I'm going to insert my second part in my first part. So I have my music that's going up, and then I'm going to insert all. I'm going from the top, so indications from the top. From the top, sorry, indications from the top here. Kickball change. Step chassé. Then I insert here, okay? I have here. This one is going to be a surprise. Basic one. Uh, sorry. Here. Um, and one. Okay? I have it all. Now, the, the next surprise is going to be, you know this? Surprise left that's going to be a little bit difficult. So I'm not going to change it. It's, uh, it's really for the for, it's little, really the last variation I'm going to do because it's a little bit risky. I'm going to do a pas de bourre here. So from the top, from here, pam pam. Okay? Chasse. Really good, really big movements, and then I'm going to pas de bourre here. Look chasse. Okay, boom, and boom. Okay, I want this one to be a surprise. Pas de bourrée, so, pam, pam, pam. So if I do it here, it's going to be up, 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 and then marches. Up, 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 up. Okay, six counts. So, from the top, a little bit of cueing, and then technique. Cueing, from the top, go. Fall down. Fall down, down, okay, go up, put your knee, jump as high as you can so you can show them with big movement, okay, you can do it with a open or with a chasse, a little bit chasse, okay, then down, then big down, down, and then you go, okay, you jump, torso, so they can learn. So if you liked it, this video, don't forget to subscribe here. Don't forget that you can have all the videos and all the choreos that you want. We have, uh, we have uh, for the beginners, for intermediate level and for the advanced level. So if you want, don't hesitate, subscribe here, follow me and you will see another things, another surprises that are going to be on my YouTube channel in the fo following uh, days. Thank you very much and see you soon. Bye-bye.